Our team coverage continues as Hurricane Henri has now been downgraded to a tropical depression. And while it may not have hit Western Mass as hard as we initially thought, that didn't change how Springfield City officials prepared. Western Mass News reporter Stacy Circasoon is live in studio with more on how city officials geared up for today. Stacy. Matt, given how windy it was, city officials ensured they had a plan in place to prepare. Springfield police respond to an average of 300 to 500 calls every day. But with a storm, storm like Henri, they expect 100 to 150 more calls. And in anticipation of that, they had to staff up. Springfield police ask residents to be patient as respond times may take longer. DPW officials expect flooding to be their biggest issue. To avoid this, they stress the importance of keeping storm drains clear of debris and leaves for drainage. Helen Colton Harris, the health commissioner of Springfield, says residents can prepare for outages by knowing just a few simple things. When we lose power, obviously food becomes a challenge. I'd ask folks to keep your refrigerators closed um, food stays good for four hours um, after you lose power, perhaps. A full freezer of 48 hours is safe, and a half freezer 24 hours is safe. Now, Harris does stress, when in doubt, throw it out. She also says residents should have at least five days of any supply of medication that they may need. PVTA officials say that if they meet unsafe conditions such as flooding or trees down, there may be a detour and wait times will change. The best way to monitor is to keep tabs on the PVTA website and alerts. All officials emphasize do not drive through a flooded area. In studio, Stacey Circusoon for Western Mass News.